Virginia Attorney General Mark Herring is making stops across the Commonwealth to show people the dangers of prescription drug and heroin abuse. According to the chief medical examiner, the number of Virginians who died due to heroin overdose doubled from 100 in 2011 to 239 in 2014. Between 2011 and 2013, every region in the Commonwealth saw an increase in heroin overdose fatalities. And last year, more Virginians were killed in heroin overdoses than in car crashes. Starting, starting, startling statistics there. So to help fight the growing issue, workers from Herring's office released a documentary called Heroin, the Hardest Hit. WSLS 10's Duke Carter is in the studio. So Duke, tell us more about this push behind the film. Well, I spoke with Attorney General Mark Herring, and he says the goal is to have an open dialogue to raise awareness about drug abuse. He wants people to know it's a problem in every corner of the Commonwealth, even here in the Roanoke Valley. Up on this, this is a bad... <laughs> Heroin is more dangerous, more addictive. Dozens of people viewed a documentary that hits heroin hard, a common drug that's abused here in the Commonwealth. And after overdosing, many don't live to talk about it. You know, I, I turned to drugs and I started using um, marijuana, alcohol, other things to, to make me feel better. Terrence Ingalls is with American Addiction Centers. Ingalls is now three years drug free. He says the road to recovery was challenging and he was drafted to play Major League Baseball but turned to prescription pills because of a back injury. It eventually led to using heroin and then he became homeless when a baseball career didn't pan out. That's when I went to get help. We have a heroin and prescription drug crisis in Virginia that's claiming the lives of hundreds of Virginians every single year. In fact, Attorney General Mark Herring says across Virginia, prescription drug and heroin overdose has reached a crisis level. Herring says over the last year, over 700 people died from heroin and prescription drug overdosing. We've got a multifaceted approach to try to address it, and we're doing everything we can at the Attorney General's office. Which includes stepping up prosecutions of dealers and traffickers and seeking sanctions against medical professionals who are putting prescription drugs out in the streets illegally. But he says the biggest push the Attorney General's office is doing is raising awareness by showing the documentary in every part of the Commonwealth. It's something Roanoke County Police say is good after 13 cases of heroin overdoses here in the county since January of this year, and five were fatal. Um, education, uh, prevention, rehabilitation for people who have already started down that path, uh, enforcement when it's appropriate. Uh, all these are important steps to combating the problem. The unpredictable nature of combating a problem before it's way too late. It, it's okay to ask for help. That. You know, it's, it's not a weakness. It's, you, you're not going to get in trouble, that it could change your life. Now, if you would like to view the documentary or are looking for info to get help for those who are struggling with abuse, head on over to our website, WSLS.com. We'll have all links for that information.